what you see here is just going to be mirrored in July. Fallon Vickers has two young children at an elementary school in Surrey. Soon, her youngest will also attend. There's seven portables that are currently taking up, I'd say, a quarter of our field right now. There's seven more coming, plus a washroom portable. So we're going to have 15 portables um, as of September. She says a lack of communication and failure to acknowledge the city's growth is to blame. This is a, an, an ingrained failure. I feel like this has continued to be the failure. Um, between the ministry and the city. There are more than 360 portables across Surrey. Last year, enrollment grew by 2,200 students. But in the last two years, uh, we honestly believe that we've been ignored. Allen says space isn't the only issue. Portables are not funded by the province's capital budget, but from the school's operating budget. It could, could and probably will, result in layoffs and cut to services because we have no choice but to put in a balanced budget. He says BC needs to build more schools, but BC's education minister says the province is playing catch up after the last government failed to invest in Surrey schools. We are in conversation with the school district. We are very cognizant of the increased enrollment. In its defense, the Ministry of Education and Child Care says between 2014 and 2017, no new schools and only one addition opened in Surrey. Since 2017, the Ministry of Education and Child Care has invested over half a billion dollars in capital in Surrey, with more funding coming soon. The half a billion dollars invested to date is creating over 10,000 student seats, the equivalent to eliminating 400 portables. But Vickers says these investments should have been put in long before. These children are essentially being isolated outside. If the school had just been built for the now current need, that wouldn't be the case. They would be inside the school with their peers, safe and sound all day during the school hours. As for now, schoolyards like this are set to see more portables in their sites. Angela Sterrett, CBC News.